I just want to talk about atheism again because I, there's a lot of things that I want to say and need to be said at this present time. I think that atheism is just intellectually naive. Uh, to, to put it bluntly, it is absolutely intellectually naive. The proponents of atheism today are intellectually naive. If you listen to Sam Harris, he goes on and on and on in an emotional way. And when you look at Richard Dawkins' books, I'm afraid that they lack that intellectual panache, as it were. Even the great Christopher Hitchens, when he was talking about Pascal, he hadn't got a clue what he was thinking about or talking about when it came to Pascal. As you know, I am pretty a bit of an expert on it, the infinite and the finite. The atheists haven't got a clue what I'm on about and what Pascal was on about, nor did Christopher Hitchens have a clue what he was on about concerning Pascal, nor for that matter does the, does the Academy know what it's on about when it's talking about Pascal. Because when people talk about Pascal, they never read Pascal, and it's as simple as that. So there's this intellectual naivety amongst modern proponents of atheism. But when you look at atheism generally, there is a massive intellectual naivety. This idea that you don't have to prove anything as an atheist is just a complete, utter naivety beyond belief. For example, whatever you believe, whatever you think, if someone challenges you, you have to give an account of yourself. But oh no, not the atheist. Atheism doesn't have to do that. And uh, the naivety just smacks you in the face like a kipper on the left side of your cheek. And then on top of that, the actual argumentation of the atheist. Well, oh well, it just gets boring. Same old arguments, same old characters, pumping the same old nonsense all the time. And it really has got to change on YouTube, and it's got to change everywhere with the atheists. They have lost all the arguments. And it's time that they actually admitted it, because we've actually demolished them uh, on many, many fronts. In fact, I was never, ever demolished. I was never demolished uh, when I was doing apologetics to atheists. Um, and that's the fact of the matter, is atheists are not capable on YouTube of providing any substantial arguments and show tremendous intellectual naivety. And... Um, I mean, I can prove this beyond a shadow of a doubt, absolutely beyond a shadow of a doubt. Take Bertrand Russell, for example. Take Bertrand Russell. If you look at Bertrand Russell, when he was writing Why I'm Not a Christian, and he was critiquing Christianity, and saying, I don't believe in Christianity because, well, it, 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 you know, it, it, it's kind of not civilized. It, it's kind of like a barbaric ma morality. That's what he would say. But it's interesting to note that when he was criticising Christianity, he was criticising Catholicism. Now it's debatable whether Catholicism is Christianity, whether it is biblical. So there's a naivety there from Bertrand Russell's scholarship is that he didn't really understand Christianity. He was banging at the wrong, wrong target.